The United Nations has reiterated its resolve to support Nigeria improve institutions and capacity aimed at transforming the nation. The UN Humanitarian Coordinator in Nigeria, Edward Callon, made this known in Abuja as the United Nations marked its 74th anniversary and also officially received the rebuilt UN House, which was attacked by Boko Haram on August uh, the 26, 2011. The UN promised to work with the Nigerian government to make reforms possible, which will help achieve the United Nations Agenda 2030 and the Sustainable Development Goals. I am delighted to welcome you all on behalf of my colleagues to the commemoration of the 74th year's year of the United Nations and the official handover after reconstruction and rehabilitation of the UN House by the federal government of Nigeria. The United Nations system has been working with the government and people of Nigeria to strengthen capacity and improve institutions, policies, and legal frameworks that will deliver human and socioeconomic development using global best practices and drawing on the comparative advantages of the UN system. I'm always proud to say that the UN as a gatekeeper of international development in Nigeria, we remain steadfast in supporting the government to strengthen institutions and do this in tandem with parliament, judiciary bodies, and other national stakeholders, as well as bilateral and multilateral partners to improve democratic and accountable governance, facilitate inclusive growth and development to eradicate poverty and provide sustainable livelihoods and humanitarian assistance and help provide and protect the weak and vulnerable in the society. 26 August 2011 was first and foremost a cowardly attack on Nigeria and its people. But it was also an attack on the values and aspirations that the United Nations seeks to uphold. Peace, freedom, prosperity, tolerance, justice. The then Secretary General described it as an assault on those who devote themselves to helping others. So the opening of UN House today is an act of defiance against such terror. We stand together to say that we will not be cowed by violence. We will continue to support the Nigerian people fulfill their dreams of a future of prosperity and security.